One thing I also want to talk about while we're still on this on the on the Super Bowl thing. Dude. That's probably one of the better halftime shows I've ever seen in my in my lifetime. Really? Yeah. Dude, that halftime show was lit. J Lo, Shakira killed it. Absolutely killed it. And here's one thing. Did you watch it or no, Cody? I did. Um, here's because I was hype about it. Cause they're both uh uh Shakira and J Lo are both are both doing it for their age right now. Yeah, no, Absolutely sure. killing it. I love it. And one thing I wanted to uh put on the spot right here right now was uh Shakira or J Lo. What do you think? Shakira. <laughs> J Lo. Really? Oh yeah. G- going back to the roots? Dude, oh yeah. Jenny hey, from the block? Dude, okay, so I Jenny you, from my heart. <laughs> <laughs> like, come on. So, She's a babe. So when J Lo came on the stage, we were like, Trey and I both were like, dude, I don't know any J Lo songs and Jess was with us and Jess is like, Oh, you know. Are you guys kidding me? And she was like, Oh, you you know plenty of J Lo songs. Like, oh. like you know them, but you don't like or you don't know them, but you definitely know them. <laughs> oh, I know. And she opened up with Jenny from the block and we were like, Oh, mm. let's go. I'm still, I'm still Jenny, from the, Jenny from the block. Yeah, she goes hard, dude. Yeah, she does. I was about right. that. Like, she was awesome. And then A Rod in the crowd just, just God. fangirling super hard. <laughs> what about the guy that got way Ooh, too close yeah. to J Lo? Hey, like, dude, he's dead right now. Yeah, A Rod was that? Goons. What was his name? I, I don't even remember I his name. Know. But, but he was up there like hitting, hitting her with like the air smack, and I was like, dude. A Rod's about to come over there and eat you, dog. Yeah. But then yeah, I saw I saw a bunch of the uh, I saw a bunch of stuff on like Instagram and Twitter of of uh, of them filming A Rod and A Rod's literally on his phone the whole time, like just fangirling super hard. I love it. <laughs> I love it. I thought it was so damn funny, man. <laughs> oh man, I, I thought it was so damn funny. Um. Uh. <laughs> I, I like to point out that. I personally wasn't the biggest fan of the halftime show. Why? Uh, I don't know. Like, I, I think it got a little weird at one point. Yeah. With like where the guys were like crawling on the. Yeah, that was you know, pretty weird. Yeah. I I wasn't the biggest fan of that. Um, also, there's been a few uh, Super Bowl halftime shows that I really like, like the one uh beyonce bruno mars and coldplay that was probably one of my favorite Janet ones. jackson no no <laughs> i was sitting right next to my grandpa when that happened that was the most awkward thing i've ever seen in my life dog were you right really there i swear i was on the couch <laughs> just me and him so it wasn't like a, a a lot of us no and no one saw it but me and him and i go how old are you when what <laughs> That was J Lo and Justin, so that was no, that was Janet Jackson. Oh yeah, and, Janet Jackson. And Justin. There was and a he, lot of people in that halftime show. He but he yeah. ripped it off, and I was like, <laughs> and my grandpa was just like this. <laughs> <laughs> like I'll never forget that in my entire life, Dude. and no one else in the house saw it. There was like fifteen people there. Just stone just, cold. Like, <laughs> finally. <laughs> That's awesome, though. Yeah. That's a moment that you and your grandpa will never forget. Forget it. Yep. <laughs> and we share. <laughs> oh, it's so great.